Riverwoods. Interesting. Well, it's no palace or even a well-to-do inn, but there might be something I can do here. This looks like an inn to me. The Sleeping Giant Inn. Perfect. We shall enter and find a bed. Hello. Who are you? You're just staring at me. What are you looking at? So, you're someone who doesn't lip wrestle. Got it. Or you're just looking for someone to kiss your boots. <laughs> if it's the latter, I'd suggest asking elsewhere. Fine. I shall. Because I am just going to find a bed and then I'm going on my way. And you are blocking my path. Ah. I join you, but there's something I want to know before you get too wasted to tell the difference between me and this wall. Tell me then. So are you so used to those kind of comments that you turn up your nose at all of them like some damn noble? I'm sorry, princess. Did you want someone to pay attention to you? What? Princess? <laughs> those two only wish they could work up the courage to whistle at me. I'll be fine. They've been harassing every pair of legs that's crossed their path for days. Yesterday they got so drunk they even wolf whistled the blacksmith. <laughs> oh, They're that's... the first they've been right to admire, though. Anyway, just give them a wide berth. Most kind of you to, uh, to help me with that. But still, why are you telling me all this? It's not like we've got anything in common. Maybe I'm just a nice guy? <laughs> I need to get going, and I wanted to foil the drunks one last time. I was tracking my wolf, Karnwir, around here. They were separated while hunting a week ago. I've been hearing rumors of bandits holding pit fights somewhere this side of Skyrim. He's all I've got, and that's the only lead. So I'm off to shut them down before something happens to him. Hmm. I'm sorry, but are you telling me that your only friend is a dog? I do believe that explains your manners. That dog is the only thing left in this world that hasn't tried to stab me in the back. You want manners? You came to the wrong country, ladyship. Ah, uh, I guess if they're running a ring, there's probably gonna be more than just a few bandits. If you wanna come, I wouldn't complain about my odds. I could certainly do worse for company. Huh. Sounds like you're trying to offer me a one night stand, but... Sounds like someone's hearing what she wants to hear. But that doesn't mean it can't be open for discussion. I don't trust anyone. Not even the man pouring my drink. The only two things I trust anymore are myself and my wolf. Got it? That is perfectly clear to me. And to be quite frankly, either sounds like a delightful endeavor, so yes, we are going to find your wolf. My promises are with you. Oh, I have no doubts about that. I'm only concerned about how long it'll take. You would have already done the same for me by now. Before you jump to any stupid assumptions or try to get him to lick your hand, Carnwood is not a pet. That wolf and I have been together since I was 17. He's closer to me than... than a brother. Got that? Look, if you two need to have your time together to enjoy yourselves in a nice private environment, then just say so. Ah, oh, born to be a jester as well, were you? Apologies if I'm too busy focusing on a matter of life and death rather than being your adoring fan. Let's get a move on. Every minute we waste here, Conrad is being held against his will. And probably worse. What, do you mean you're going right now? But I'm going to have a sleep. Good night. Still, he's quite handsome, I suppose. What I'd give to have a hunk of a man uh, like too. that. The ale is Look, look, this is between you and me, but I am a powerful wizard. But I seem to have misplaced my spell. Where can you tell me where I can find more magic? Oh, it takes someone to tell me about this. Looking to blow yourself up? I hear that's what magic does to you. There's a college in Winterhold that teaches magic. Unless that blew up too. Be a lot safer just to have the Jarl's wizard teach you a thing or two. You say there's a wizard for the yard? I see. Okay, thank you very much. All I, right, then. I, yep. I... Ale's going bad. I guess you don't have potatoes in your ears after all. Just make sure we get a fresh batch in <laughs> soon. Come on in. Just stoke the fire. Take a seat and get the cold out. Yes, I'm looking for a room. Need a room? 
Yes. Talk to Delphine. Until next time. Fine. Are you Delphine? Excuse me. Are you? No, please don't go to sleep. I, I would like to, to. Excuse me. Excuse me. You're that visitor been poking around. Yes. I would like to rent a room for the night. Sure thing. It's yours for a day. Thank you. Now, where is it? Where's the room? Is this the room? No, this is your room. Which room is it I'm sleeping in? You're going to bed. Well, good night. I'm terribly sorry for slamming this in your face. This looks like it. You can get your own room. Ah! Oh, so warm fire. Lovely potatoes. Mm. Oh, good morning. Oh, you've woken me up. Well, fine. Let's go find your 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 precious wolf. Tell me. What I'd give to have a hunk of a man like that. I'm sure you would. But still, uh, his name is Bishop. He's he's my companion. Oh, I'd love to get him in my bed. Yeah, I can see that, but we didn't sleep together, so... Oh my god! It's raining, how hideously hideous. You never know, sometimes trade... Sometimes traders have nice things. We are done talking about this! Oh, <clears throat> a customer. Sorry you had to hear that. Ah, there's no problem. Simply... Well, I don't know what you overheard, but the Riverwood Trader is still open. Feel free to shop. That's perfectly fine. So look, listen, my man. I am looking for a powerful spell that will keep me and me alone safe when I am out exploring the wild world. I think I have a few old spell books laying about. If you want more, you'll have to go to the College of Winterhold. That sounds perfectly fine. Which spell books do you have? Hmm. Well, uh, frost magic seems perfectly fine. I shall. I. I. You. Hmm. I shall learn this, this, and this. Now I shall. Favorite you. Ah, this feels. A dragon! I saw a dragon! So, they think people who saw the dragon are crazy, don't they? Now, where's this wolf of yours? What do you want to ask? When did you find Gitwin? I got my wolf Karnwir when I was just a boy. We survived together, we hunted together. Someday we'll die together. And that suits me just fine. Very well. Hmm. Let's see. We need to find out where this wolf of yours has been held, and I shall use my far superior detective skills to find him. Let us go. In this rain. Hmm. Where, oh, where could they be? You say there were some people who were talking about it. In this side of Skyrim, you say? You two. Tell me. Hey, baby. You want to lip wrestle with me, do you? I know you do. I... Do not. You there. Oi, oi. Look at this fine lass. Oh, she's a beauty who looks a bit parched. I think I may offer her to buy her a pint of brew. Not if I get to her before you do. You always go after the pretty women and leave the beast for the rest of us. I see. <laughs> I can't help it if women find me fascinating. Besides, you have plenty of women My to chest is from. quite flat, you know. A fair maiden like her would be a waste for a man like you. However, that is also true. Hey, she must be a witch then. Look at those eyes. It puts some spell on me. My eyes? Well, fine, goodbye. I am... I am off. You hear me? I am not talking to you, and I'm not talking to you. I may talk to you. But we are off, you hear me? We are going and finding your wolf. Before we find your wolf, there is one person I must talk to in this town. He helped me out of a... Magical... Explosion... Probably? And I must go repay him. Hello. Hello. Hello! 
Ah, there you are. Hello. Hello, Adva. Listen, you should go to Solitude and join up with the Imperial Legion. We could really use someone like you. Um, that may... The rebels have themselves a dragon. Um, General Tullius is the only one who can stop them. Look, but... Dragons were all dead years ago. Look, it's, it's, it cannot have been a dragon. So did I. If the damn Stormcloak somehow found one, or woke it up, the war might be about to take an ugly turn. Hard to believe it was just a coincidence. Hmm. And the first dragon anyone's seen for centuries attacks just as Alfred was about to be executed. You spring a very good point. Um, just one question. Uh, who on earth were the rest of those people who were with me? You didn't know? That was Ulfric Stormcloak and his top lieutenants. Uh, I must say I have not been paying much attention to what has been happening here, so... Oh, right. You were caught trying to cross the border into Skyrim, weren't you? You're not kidding. Ulfric's the leader of the Stormcloaks. You know, the traitors trying to break Skyrim away from the Empire. That's not a good idea. Um, but that being said, that if he has all this power, then how on earth did you capture him? A masterstroke by General Tullius. He's only been in charge here for a few months, but he's turned things around for the Empire. We've been trying to catch Ulfric since the war started, but he always seemed to slip through our fingers, like he knew we were coming. This time, the General turned the tables on him. Ulfric rode right into our ambush with only a few bodyguards. That sounds very funny. He surrendered pretty meekly, too. So much for his death or glory reputation. I thought we were taking Ulfric back to Cyrodiil, but I guess the general changed his mind. You know the rest. That sounds... very... interesting. I shall see you again later. Good luck. If you get a chance, look me up in solitude. I might just do that. That's very nice of you. That's me done. Let's go. Now, where did you say this... this... this wolf of yours was last seen? These bandits, you said. You mean, they're on the other side of this very, 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 very large mountain? This very, very, very large mountain, I must say. Did I say this mountain was very large? Fine. We shall go there, then. Let's go. This is the... What the... Yes, I know this is the wrong way out, but look! That strange light was there last night. It does not look normal. We are to investigate before we investigate yours. It may have relevance. This may be why you came to this town, after all. Now, I don't want to go through the water, so I shall climb over here. Um, let's just... I'll just, just... I'm just gonna step up here and over, and maybe if I can just swing my leg down... <laughs> it's cold and it's wet. Ugh. Do not laugh. I now have a strange feeling that uh, if I go any further, there may be some objections. I say we turn around and go the other way. Onwards! <sighs> it's so wet and cold. I hope you're happy. Well, I'm sure you are, uh, being a rough, country, outdoorsy person like you are. Oh, that looks interesting. It's almost like a very large... And uh, it's wolves! Aha! Stand back! I can deal with these. Because I am a master wizard! <laughs> <laughs> I'm glad I can entertain you. You see, it feels like, with you behind me, that you're hunting me. And I don't particularly like it. But I shall keep my eye on you. That must be a wolf. But it's your wolf. Let's go see. Uh, Kaki Quinn? <laughs> oh! You're not Kaki Quinn! I heard you laugh, and that was not funny. It certainly does look stunning in the fog, does it not? I've always enjoyed fog. It reminds me of frost. But it's like cold clouds. Actually, cold's not that nice. But fog is nice. That looks like a prisoner. Not that I would know. I do not know anything about being a prisoner. I'd like you to know that. 
because obviously I am not used to casting spells in this region. I obviously know the spells, but I just I'm not used to them. We must go to that place because I've heard the 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 they, they called it the Yearl. The Yearl has a wizard who I must speak to. So we go in this way first. This wolf of yours had better be worth it if we're going to be travelling through this amount of s dreadful Skyrim weather. Hello. Halt. City's closed with the dragons about. Official business only. I... I have news about Helgen. I was there. I was there during the dragon attack. Fine. But we'll be keeping an eye on you. That is perfectly fine. But let me through right now. Let me through. I shall be going through. I am going through now. I have gone through. Do you get to the Cloud District very often? Oh, what am I saying? Of course you don't. You don't know that. I could get to the Cloud District if I wanted to, because I am... Hmm. Goit. <laughs> yes, I have important business. I am... I mostly deal with I'm... petty thievery and drug and brawls. That's fine. Been too long since we've had a good bandit raid. You brute! I have important business with the with the with. Goodbye. Right. Now let's see. Where would this wizardly well, person be? What would you have me do then? Hello, Nothing? wizard. 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 My lord. Please. Oh, that looks a bit this like a no wizard's room. But What's the I meaning of this interruption? Jarl Balgrup is not receiving just... visitors. Who's this? I. I, I have news, I have news from Helgen, about the dragon attack, yes. Well, that explains why the guards let you in. Come on then, the Jarl will want to speak to you personally. He, I, um, yes, yes, they, he, he should talk to me because I, I am important. And I may be just parroting, but I, yes, hello. So, you were at Helgen. You saw this dragon with your own eyes? Why, yes I did. I had a great view of the dragon. And it destroyed Helgen. And the last I saw, it was heading this way. You should be prepared. Let all your men get really ready because it's heading this way. By Ismir, Irileth was right. Well done. You sought me out on your own initiative. Yes, I did. You've done Whiterun a service. And I won't forget it. Oh, Here, that's... Take this as a small token <sighs> of my esteem. This stuff is that heavy! Is another thing you could do for me. Suitable for someone of your particular talents? I'm sorry, I don't become a court wizard. Come, let's go find Faringar, my court wizard. You already have a court He's wizard. He's been looking into a matter related to these dragons and rumors of dragons. However, I did want to speak to him, so yes, let's do that. Bishop. Uh, take. Yep, got something for me? Yes. I need you to take this stuff. It's really, really, really heavy. Uh. I want it this right now. Father, I think I found someone who can help you with your dragon project. Go ahead and fill him in with all the details. Yes, tell me so the details. The old thinks you can be of use to me. Yes? Oh yes, he must be referring to my research into the dragon. What he just said? So, you're needing me to do what exactly? I, uh, learned of a certain stone tablet said to be housed in Bleak Falls Barrow. A dragon stone, said to contain a map of dragon burial sites. Go to Bleak Falls Barrow, um, find this tablet, no doubt interred in the main chamber, and bring it to me. Simplicity itself. Uh, yes. Yes, I shall do that, but, um... Firstly, I must ask you, are you able to teach me more about your type of magic? A prospective student, are you? Well, I'm afraid I'm not much good at teaching. You should try your luck at the College of Winterhold. I see. But you have some spell books I could read, do you not? Take a look. Aha, perfect. And oh my gosh, you have much, much spells. You know, this is a priority that. now. No. You should join Anything we can use College to fight this dragon or dragons. Yes. We need it quickly, before it's too late. Yes, that is of very course, true. Of course, Jarl You seem to have found me an able assistant. Indeed I am. I'm sure he will prove most useful. 
Of course I shall. Succeed at this, and you'll be rewarded. White Run will be in your debt. Yes, of course. Thank you. Just like the debts which you gave me that really heavy steel armor. Yes, we should be doing this. We should be doing this straight, straight away. Straight, straight away. I can't question his judgment. I'm not asking you to Bishop, we are going to leave the city and run. flip away as fast as possible because I am not getting involved with dragons. Goodbye. Yeah.